Miles is up. I've just given him a wash and he's got dressed for the day. I am currently on Pancake Station. I think they are pretty much done. I love this heat plate. It's so, or hot plate, should I say? It's so good and quick. It doesn't want my pancakes, do you, Vi? Nope. She's a cereal lover, definitely. Alistair's pancakes, banana, and a bit of maple syrup. Oh, is he looking at you? Hello. <laughs> Hello. Rockety rock, 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 rock. Yeah. <laughs> right, I've just been sorting myself out and just tidying up really. Graham's gone back to work. Alistair's outside playing on a scooter. I'm listening to Miles. I'm actually watching him on the cam. Um, he's, well, he's supposed to go down for his second nap. Um, it's been over two hours since he slept. He is super tired. And because he kind of is pretty good with his like cues of when he sleeps, I know he's so ready for a nap, it's just whether he or not he wants to fight it. You can hear him having a little grizzle. He only pretty much does that most of the time um, when it's nap time. He kind of needs to sleep. But um, if he does go for a nap, fingers crossed, I might actually be able to do a sit down video, which is one thing I never get to do anymore. And it's pretty much my plan for this morning when he naps. Um, it is 10 past 10, it's only 10 past 10. Yeah, so he woke up over an, over two hours ago from his first nap. He's so ready. But anyway, I'm just faffing about, just waiting in for him to settle, if he settles. Yeah, I'm not sure. He's pretty much asleep, he's just having a little moan. But I think he's, I think he's pretty much, can you see him? I think he's pretty much gonna go to sleep. He, look how tired he looks, bless him. Oh, really? Right, I've just finished my video, my postpartum four month update. Alistair's looking, he, um, he's, yeah, looking at the, the really sad, leaves me a lump in my throat actually, devastation of Australia. It's just so sad. I just, oh, all the animals and just homes and oh, lives. Oh, anyway. I'm such a hormonal person. Anyway, I think I might miss, make myself a cup of tea. Sorry if today's been a bit lame so far. Quarter to 11. Not really doing anything. It's raining, so you don't really want to go out. It's raining. It's kind of like, keeps drizzling. Miles is still asleep. He's been asleep for about half an hour. I'm hoping to get a little bit more time. Got one of my new mugs for Christmas. How cute is that? I do actually need to do some washing. What are you doing? Are you busy? Dolly dressing. Oh my god, that's so cute. I love these things, these little dolly dressing activity packs. Very cute, she's got lots of presents. Lovely. I'm gonna get your washing because not now. What do you mean not now? I need to. It's a whole week's worth of school uniforms. Back to school on Monday. Right, time to play. He's up. I was gonna be productive and try and do a bit of editing on my laptop, but my laptop's dead anyway. So I put that on charge and then he woke up anyway, so never mind, we're gonna do some reading, got my books. But your book, should I say? He's a bit whingy. Um, don't know. I think his teeth are playing him off. He's just, yeah, just doesn't seem. I don't know. Just a bit whingy. Um, and I'm watching the. What is it called? This is a really sweet film. It's actually a. Bit, I think it's a kids' film as well. Yeah. The Odd Life of Timothy Green. It's a really, really sweet film actually about a little boy that comes into a couple's life that they can't have children. Well, they, I don't, I don't think they can have children. I think they've been trying and whatever. But this little boy comes into their life and it's just such a sweet story. So anyway, we're gonna read. We're gonna read as wide as he could. Big nut brown hair, had even longer arms. But I love you this much, he said. 
Hmm, that is a lot for little nut brown hair. Alright, I'm just cracking on with the kiddies' lunches. That's pretty much done. Toasties, fruit, yogurt. I think I might give them a shared packet of crisps as well. Video nap up. Nap number 52 of the day, probably. Oh, you smell so good. You smell so good. You do. So squishy. Right, I have been in mum mode, mummy mode. Nappies, naps, feeding, pretty much the last few hours. I had you on charge. Kids, I've just been so good today. I've just been very much entertaining themselves. We've just watched a couple of things on TV. It's quarter past two. They are actually going off to mother-in-law's for a little sleepover. Sometimes they go on Saturdays and obviously where they are back at school it means that Saturday is pretty much the only day. So Violet is finally putting some normal clothes on. No, I'm fine. Yeah, and I've just packed their bags to go for the night. I don't want to go with these leggings, are so you can, We can wear them, it's fine. You're only going across the field. It's not a big deal, is it? Okay. Mars has had three naps today, I believe. Yeah. Morning. Oh, yeah, yeah. He's had three naps. He's only just woke up from his third one. It's such a dull day, but um, the kids are going off to mother-in-law's now. Alistair's outside. I have just packed his bag. Mom, I need to take down my trousers. Bike. I am actually going to pop down to our local town. I am desperate to get another one of these containers here. This is full up with baby clothes, and I have a bag full which I want to put into a box. I just want to organise it and just fold up properly. Um, yeah, you know when you've just got a task that you want to do and that I've had for the last couple of weeks that I've wanted to do and I just think I might as well get out of the house, get Miles out of the house. It just breaks up the day a little bit. Right, I am back. We were out of the house for about an hour, hour and 20, something like that. It was good to just get a bit of fresh air. It's pretty fresh out there, but it was just nice. He had a little mini nap on the way back, but yeah, it was good just to have a little browse. I went to Sainsbury's actually. I picked up a couple of like food items that um, were actually cheaper in Sainsbury's than on Cardo, and I thought, well, I might as well just save myself some money. I'm here already. Um, and then I also got Mr. some sleep suits. He's, I think I mentioned he's. He's, all his sleep suits are actually three to six months, but they're all getting really, really tight in the feet. So I need to, um, I've got in one pack of sleep suits six to nine. These look absolutely massive though. But I know after one wash, they will probably shrink down. But I saw these in Sainsbury's, pack of three for 10 pounds, which I think is really good value. Um, they actually have the feet on as well, like gripper feet. So if your baby's on the move and actually like nearer to moving age, um, that's actually quite handy, but um, I just thought they were really sweet as well So this one has a little cheetah on and then this one is a cheetah print all over and then this one has More of the sort of jungle animals, which is probably my favorite one But for 10 quid I thought bargain because most of the ones in next are usually I think 17 pounds for a pack of three um, And then also this bib was half price and I thought we're going to get to weaning stage at some point in the next couple of months. And I thought it was pretty cute as well. It's kind of, I remember having these little ones with the arms and it's kind of um, waterproof as well, if that makes sense. Yeah, and he's here. He's here. You had a little nap, didn't you? You needed it. Before the night ahead. Me and Graham are actually having a Indian takeaway tonight and we've actually pre-ordered it. Um, this place which we've ordered it from, it's not our usual local restaurant, 
but Graham had a curry in there a few weeks ago. He had a takeaway curry um, actually delivered to our house, which is totally unheard of. Like we don't usually have um, any takeaway companies that deliver to us. It's just too much hassle. But Graham was like, oh, we can pre-order. So we pre-ordered our curry to be delivered for seven o'clock tonight. So hopefully, well, should definitely, Miles should be in bed by then. So we're gonna have a little date night in. Obviously it's kind of like my birthday meal, but we're at home and we pick a movie or box set or something to watch. There's so much on at the moment. We just got, we've got so much to watch, but you know, when you just don't know which to watch. i tell you one thing we did um, start last night. It was called White House Farm. Based on a true story, it's on ITV. I can't remember what day it's on because we, we basically recorded it on catch up, but it's 50 minutes long. I think there may be a couple of episodes, but it's really, really good. And yeah, it's it's about like a murder, murder mystery, but it's based on a true story. I love stuff like that. Um, one thing we have been watching as well is Dracula. Um, it was recommended by a friend and again is really long hour and a half each episode so super long there's only three episodes um what else we've been watching the new sas who dares wins i love that <laughs> that was not me that was him <laughs> i love that um yeah i love finding new things to watch Oh, and one thing that I went in for was that one of these containers. I've already got one filled up, so I thought I would um, or, well, just organise his baby clothes because I'm going to do a baby sale, I think I'd mentioned that. And then I also got four of these little... Don't ask me what I'm going to do with these containers. They're only 39p. I got four of them. This is our wild night in. Wild night. Folding, washing with baby. Have we got spots on? Oh, God. Turn it over. All right, just got baby down to bed. And we just had our Indian, mm, I love it, chicken Morgan Josh. I've got for delivery. I don't know where Graham's just gone. But anyway, I'm going to dish up. I'm absolutely starving. Nibble. Mm. I'm going to get a rice to share. Switch frame actually. I've actually not had the curry from this place before, so it's gonna be interesting to try some, you know, a different place. Looks actually really nice. Looks a lot darker yours, doesn't it? I'll let you dish yours up. Mm, that's mine. Lot, like richer, do you know what I mean? Yeah. Oh my god. Have well. we been missing out? Have we been going to our local and actually... We could have just stayed at home and had it delivered to us and it's back. I know. Good morning everybody. It is Sunday. Oh, we've had oh, a tiring morning. It's just um, not been terrible, but Miles decided to start the day at like 5.20 this morning. So, we were up playing for an hour, managed to get him back down by, actually about an hour and a half, managed to get him down, but back down by seven, and then he's been awake since eight. Yeah, it's just a, a sort of early start, it's just so hard, it's so dark. Um, I'm just getting breakfast now, it is 20 past eight, I've just been feeding him and yeah, trying to get breakfast in between. He's in the lounge, so we're gonna go in there. Got my breakfast, my porridge with my puree that I made yesterday, coffee. Oh, there is the little culprit, <laughs> looking so sweet. Um, yeah, I'm looking at you. I've got a bit of washing to fold that I'm gonna do now. 
The kids obviously went to mother-in-law's last night. They will be back soon. Today is like our family day. The weather has been absolutely crazy. Like it was a bit cold and wet yesterday, but in through the night, we've just had like crazy winds just howling through the house. Um, but yeah, it's, it's, it looks nice now. It's died down and it just looks like it's supposed to be dry and sunny, which was what the forecast said. Um, we're actually gonna go to Marwell today. Um, Graham was saying, what do you wanna do for your birthday? Cause obviously my birthday was Thursday. If you didn't know, if you follow me on Instagram, you'll know. Um, my birthday was Thursday. And we went out for lunch and I said I wanted to do like a family day on the weekend. And I could, I'm like trying to think of things that we can all do, like even miles, like without like having to like, I don't know, do it in slots or I don't know, you know what I mean? Just trying to find something we can all enjoy. So I decided on Marwell, not necessarily the best thing to do around this time of year. However, we, it's getting out, getting some fresh air. It's a really nice long walk. There's loads of different sort of play areas around, dotted around. They've got, they've actually, I think since the last time we went there, they've actually had a few renovations as well. So they've got a few more different types of animals in and reptiles and they have bats and yeah, it's just something we can all do. So that is what we're gonna do today and it's not too far either. Hi. <laughs> Hi, little my little chunker. My little chunky junk. I've literally just swapped him over. This is a six to nine month vest from Next. This is like the pack um, that I'm gonna swap over because these are just too small now. It's really hard to do up the poppers. Some of them are quite stained as well. So we're gonna swap them over. Get some of the um, bigger ones in. And like the baby girls I bought yesterday, I've got another pack as well. I am gonna put them in the wash, tumble dry once, and I reckon they will probably end up fitting him. Won't they? Yeah. Cause your other ones are just too tight. You're just too long. This is the part that I struggle with. Literally, his like uh, torso length. Right, we've arrived at Marwell Sea, finally. <laughs> finally made it. Just going in. And it's dry, a bit windy. Go over here. Is it Fish, fish, fish. Mask got his giraffe. With way better hair. Yeah. Something that grows on a tree, anything else? Oh. Leaves, fantastic oh. guys, you're absolutely right. Because these animals eat leaves, lots of juicy leaves that giraffe and lots of animals love to eat. And if I could borrow you guys for a moment, especially the adults, if you could have your hands so your fingertips point to the ceiling and your elbows point to the ground. So grown ups on you, from your fingertips to your elbow, that's about the same length as a giraffe's tongue. He's a anymore. little baby. He's a little baby. Get me in. Get you in. Snow right. <laughs> 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 leopard. He's, he's more interested in them. Um, the children. Looking this way. That side. Bye bye. Right, we are home. I'm so tired. It's like quarter four. We had such a good time in Marwell. Yeah. It's pretty cold, but it was, yeah, the sun was out, it was dry. We actually bumped into a couple of friends, which was, yeah, didn't expect that. So, it was, yeah, it was just really, really nice. Um, and yeah, surprising how, like, even through the winter, you can spend over three hours there easy so it was a good like family day the cafe though was absolutely heaving i really wish i would have took a picnic we didn't take a picnic um so yeah that was just a little bit stressful and like feeding miles 
in the cold. Was, he was in like a big snowsuit. It was basically me that was cold. But yeah, it was a good day. Graham's gone back off to work. Um, Miles is here. He was a little angel when we were out. We pretty much just slept all the fresh air. He slept most of it and then Graham just carried him around just to see a few things. Um, yeah, it was a good day. I am just, yep, killing some time. Oh. Changing miles. I received a couple of things in the post. Well, not in the post, in the, um, like an order from next, from the next sale, the Christmas one. Got miles, some PJs for next year. It says, I'm snow cute. I don't know if you can see those. So they're his, like, Christmas PJs. They've got, like, little gold Christmas trees on. Right, I've got one child in the shower. I actually cleaned out the hamsters with Violet only to find and be a little bit shocked that one hamster was missing. Um, we found it, it's gone behind the sofa and I have no idea, how, one, how it got out and two, how it got all the way from Violet's room to the sofa. I'm just, so it's still there, I'm waiting for Graham to get back um, and trying to figure out how it got out. I mean, they're much bigger than what they were obviously and, and the bars are tiny. I don't know, Violet has no idea. None of the doors were open and obviously we've got two hamsters so they would have both got out if the door was open. Um, don't know. Miles is here with me. <laughs> yeah, hello. He's getting tired, it's nearly five o'clock. We're just waiting for Gray to get back because he's had obviously, well he's had the day off on like the afternoon off pretty much, lunchtime to afternoon. He's still work to do so he's just catching up on what he's missed um yeah and i'm just reading i actually um decided to get a annual pass for marwell so i can take miles my friend actually already has one so i'm just reading through um how you can use it you can get discounts off for like family members as well which is quite good and you can actually visit other zoos just once so you can visit we've been to bristol zoo before Chester, Colchester, Edinburgh, Highland Wildlife Park, Newquay, there's a couple more, but um, yeah, so I've got my own little annual pass for me and Miles, because obviously he's free anyway, yeah, we could go to my well zoo whenever we want now, we went downstairs, went in that one, straight back out, went down there, had a drink, <laughs> been kind of like muscling around down there for a bit, and he's gone up, no he's gone in that one, naughty Graham, Right, I am doing ham and cheese toasties for dinner because I am not in the mood for cooking. It's just getting late. Already near half past five. Kids have had showers. Back to school tomorrow. And I love a toasting. I think I showed you my toasty maker already that I got for Christmas. And we have used it pretty much every other day at least. Look at this. Whoa, we've got Violet doing some tidying. Still got the sofa out because of where the hamster was, wasn't Graham. it, Vi? Naughty Graham. Let's hope Daddy sorted it out and he won't get out. <laughs> One of the bars looked a bit wider, like he could squeeze through it, didn't it? Whoa. And then I'm going to get Miles to bed and then tidy up the chaos. Got a big smile. Big smile. Little chunker. Outgrowing that, outgrowing the mat, outgrowing. I, I know. Why? Why is he so long? Oh. Don't you? Why are you outgrowing everything before your time? You're only four months old. Not even four months old. Changed over all his vests because they were all too small. It's basically as long as the mat. Oh my god. Uh, but I don't think you can get any bigger. <laughs> I think that's just standard size. It's not like you can buy an extra large long mat. Super sized baby mat. Super size. Those chunky thighs. Oh, I got it and then I lost it straight away. Good morning, everybody. I just I wanted to come on and quickly end my video. I've had a bit of a rough night. I've had a really bad stomach. And um, yeah, I went a bit out of my state. I don't know if it was the toast, the toasty, me and Grey both had bad stomachs overnight, awful, like, 
getting to the toilet through the night is horrendous. Um, I don't think we've got bugs, like I don't think it's that severe, but oh my god, it's just on top of like night feeds and stuff. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty, I'm pretty knackered. Um, but yeah, it must be, it, I, I think it's down, I had made a cheese ham and toasty last night and I think, I don't, I couldn't put my finger on when I'd opened the ham and I reckon the ham may have just upset our tummies. I mean, I don't know 100%, but I can't think of anything else. Like the kids are absolutely fine and they didn't have ham, they just had cheese. So yeah, who knows. But um, yeah, I just wanted to end my video anyway. Um, I really hope you enjoyed it. Let's hide to this greasy mob. I need to get in the shower this morning. Um, but yeah, I really hope you enjoyed it. I did actually do a weekly vlog last week, but I have so many corrupt um, like parts of footage that I am struggling to actually get it up. So I I think I need some new SD SD cards, and I think that's the problem. They they start to wear down quite quickly when you use them so often. Um, so I actually don't think I'm even going to be able to get that video up, which I'm annoyed about because it was like part of my birthday. It was just a you know a few bits in there that I would have liked to have kept being kept as a memory sort of thing to put out. It's a lot of the time what I like to do, but hopefully this will come out, and yeah, it's not quite a weekly vlog, but it's better than nothing anyway. And yeah, hopefully a new weekly vlog will come out the week after. But anyway, I hope you have a great week. It is absolutely peeing down today. I'm gonna have like a, a really restful day. I think I need it. But I will catch you all soon. And um, yeah, any video requests again, let me know. Um, I think I've got a postpartum video coming out before this. Um, and you enjoyed my grocery hauls, actually. I've had quite a lot of requests of what I eat in the day. I'm going to get one of those up this week as well. But yeah, have a great week and I will see you all soon. I want to be